Okay guys, this is my brand new just restored 2.0 firmware iPod Touch. See we have a scientific calculator and app store right there. I'm not gonna go through settings. I think you guys believe me. It's 2.0. Okay. And iTunes you see there. But now the big surprise. Okay, the 2.0 uh, jailbreaking software, Ponich tool for Mac, was just released today by the iPhone dev team. They've worked really hard on it, and here it is. They released it to us all, so here we go. We're going to open it up, and right here it's copyrighted the iPhone dev team. The software is not for commercial use, just a warning they put in it. Okay, and the cool part about this new this new um, one is that you get options. You have iPhone here iPod Touch, or you can do a 3G iPhone, which is a brand new one, because they had, a, they had um, wait to release it, because they, they had put this new, because there's a new bug, for, there's a bug for the 3G iPhone, jailbreaking, so here it is, and it's jailbreak, unlocking should be soon, but there's no unlocking yet, so here we go, I have an iPod Touch, like you saw earlier, so I'm going to click here to continue, I'm going to zoom back out, okay. Okay, here it is, and this is the same like the old one, building an IPSW, and here's my brand new, or just downloaded 2.0 firmware. I'm going to click to continue, and they this is just asking you if you want it to be on your desktop. If they want, if you want to save the custom firmware onto your desktop, you're going to say yes, and now it's just going to build an IPSW. Trust me, this takes a long time, so I'm going to come back when it's done. Okay, just finished building the IPSW or firmware, and now the pop-up says, Has your iPod Touch been pwned before? And they're talking about 2.0 firmware right now, and basically nobody's has yet, so you're just going to click no. And just the way you know is if it has a pineapple logo, if it has a pwned logo. Okay, guys, now what you have to do is you have to put it into DFU mode. So what that means is you have to have your iPod unlocked, turn it all the way off, slide power off and then it gets kind of tricky what you have to do is you have to press and hold the home and power button for 10 seconds then release the power button and leave the home button on and then it'll go into DFU mode and your and iTunes will say there's an iPod in recovery mode and you have to restore well you guys should know okay now iTunes has just says an iPod has been detected in recovery mode and you must restore this iPod before it can be used with iTunes. And since we just built our IPSW right down here, I don't know if you can see that, but that's the IPSW we just built. So now I believe in Ponage Tool, it's end Ponage Tool. And now with our iPod, you're going to Alt Restore if you're on a Mac. Find our, our custom restore. Click Choose. And there we go. It's going to be extracting our software and it's just going to uh, restore it. And I'll come back. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.